for my internet type people. You can tell it's the end of the vacation because I'm looking tired and I'm feeling tired. Woke up here. I just heard the cat jingle across the grass. It's raining out. Um, and we're going to Salem. What a spoopy day for Salem. Right, Luke? Huh? A spoopy day for Salem? Spoopy. Spoopy. Oh. <laughs> Look at that spoopy fog. Okay, it's raining cats and dogs. I jumped out of the car to get in that insane line over there for the Witch Museum, and Luke's gonna find parking. Hopefully. I'm in line. It's insane. I think I just walked into someone's backyard, but I just assume everything here's a museum, right? We got tickets for 11.30 and it is 10.15-ish? 10.15. Ha ha! 10.30. Okay, so we're gonna go find some coffee. <gasps> the Salem Witch Psychic Fair. Spoopies. So if you didn't know, um, Luke's grandpa... Aunt. Well... My grandpa's got nothing to do with witches. Okay. His aunt is a witch. She's in a coven. And his grandpa, not a witch, nothing to do with witches but does readings Nothing to do with Salem. and they call it spoopies. <laughs> this sums up the town of Salem. Old timey photos where you dress up. This is Deadwood, isn't it? This is Deadwood. Deadwood for spoopy things. It's weird how Deadwood is older than this. Because... Wood? Yeah. Wood buildings versus brick buildings. Man, people using bricks were smart. It's like the Three Little Pigs story. See, the bizarre, bizarre. The bizarre bizarre. Take a pick. New Salem Sioux or Salem? Uh, New Salem Sioux. Stickers. What is your excitement? I don't know. I'm pretty low. I hear it's cheesy and I'm ready for the cheese. Did you learn a lot from which museum? Luke said, not many people were killed. Yeah, but hold on. I was expecting a massacre. Yeah, no, it was, it was what, 12 people? Something like that. So that was fun. There was no animatronics, but it was all like wax figures. Yeah, there was no movement, just bad. Voiceover. Audio. By bad, you mean? No, I, I'm, I'm actually having a hot turkey. I remember what I like. Now we're at a place called Red's Cafe. And we're sitting by the. Yeah, it's exciting. It's Americana. That Bloody Mary, that celery, that, yes, stuffing, turkey, cranberry sauce. Apparently, if we follow this red line, We'll see all the historic things, like that man right there. Oh, there he goes, there he goes. Most efficient way to walk, right there. We're in a gravestone area. What is this called? A graveyard. Cemetery. Oh, I thought that was a, this is cool. Look how old it is. They look like fake Halloween tombstones. They're based on something, and this is what they're probably based on, which is why these- This one right here? Look like the things you're saying. <laughs> you know? I know, I do know, I realize that. That's like freaking out when you see like, a celebrity because there's somebody with a celebrity mask on. Because they look like a person. I think they just were trying to sound fancy. He lied the turd, ye body. Is Mary ye body. Of your leg. Latte. Ye latte. <laughs> Reverend Mr. John Higginson. Son of Higgins. Departed this life March ye ninth. Which shall sound and wait for life. Oh, this old tree. So gnarly. Her grave, his grave. Yes. Yes, Queen. I wonder what this place is like when it's not October. I feel like it's not nearly this exciting, but it's cool. Salem Wax Museum. Oh, yes. Apple cinnamon burns. Okay, there's one witch door, and here's another one. And these are not touristy. These are like, well, real to them. A man bought a broom in there, and you can get a reading from someone with a master's degree from Harvard. So, you know, don't say higher ed's dead. 
Mr. Grumpy Seagull. That's that's a street name. And that's scary. Yeah. Alright. What is that made out of? Do I touch it? Should I touch it? Ooh. I think it's a nylon with some stuff inside. Dave's flower shop knows the theme. They're all about it. I just love a good bed and breakfast. And this is a good looking bed and breakfast. I tried to look up more information about this place. Oh, House of Seven Gables. It didn't seem like it was that incredibly important. Um, so, but that's what it is. There's Luke. This door, it's a good color. I bet at one point this was a real mall. But now, it's not. There's just witch things. My feet are wet. Are your feet wet? Next I'm wearing waterproof boots. My legs oh. are wet. My feet are soaked. It's still raining. It has been all day. Love rain though, but this is a lot. I think you should keep your wellies in the car. Forever? <laughs> yeah, just stay out there and better than just live in the back of the car. For emergencies. That is a good idea. And then, yeah, so we've kind of seen all of it. It is kind of a big town. Everything feels like downtown. Everything's very walkable. Um, we followed the red line. Now we gotta get in the car and have a, a long drive. I'm not sure how long, but we gotta drive ahead of us. So probably we'll edit this, maybe. I'm not sure. I gotta get the car keys. Found the car. Let's do this. I could say about my journey uh, in, in my life, really, but also the, the job brought. The views here are ridiculous. Especially this one. Hey, oh! Yeah, just the fog and the trees and the filming doesn't do it justice. It's been gorgeous. Ithaca is gorgeous? Uh uh. All of these coasts are gorgeous. Just the northeast seems beautiful. Hi, everyone. I realized I never ended my vlog. Luke and I drove home. We got home really late and then went to bed and worked all week and now I'm editing them. So sorry about the delay. <laughs> Um, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.